This is, see, what I thought was going to be a, a, a relaxed game is definitely not. Look at these guys attacking. Holy s***. How's it going, everybody? I'm IGP, and welcome to Life in Bunker. This one's developed by Flock Studios, and it's a sandbox bunker building game, where you're the warden of an entire bunker, sheltering people who have fled from a nuclear disaster until the surface can be inhabited again. Now, this game reminds me a lot of Planet Base. It's one of those management games that you have to take care of an entire colony. And to do so, you have to mine for resources, plant vegetables, uh, take care of your people, and watch out for enemies. The theme of it, however, fits more of a Fallout or a sheltered type game, but it definitely fits more on the planet-based side, so I think you guys are going to enjoy this type of a game. It's a nice mix. It's actually a little bit more relaxed than normal management games. There is a lot of stuff that you have to pay attention to, but it's very calming in the sense that the game just feels more relaxing. But the game comes out on the 25th of February. Right now, we have early access to the game. If you want some more information, links will be in the description below. Now, if you guys are truly excited to see more, I'm willing to put out another episode of this tomorrow if we can hit 500 likes on this video today. So if a part two is intriguing to you, be sure to hit that like button. So we're going to go ahead and get started and create a new game. Of course, I can give it its own name, but actually this is kind of nice in giving it a random seed. We can actually customize the parameters of certain things like the ore and the caverns and how often they spawn or how frequently we want to see them. So we're going to leave everything as it is. I'm going to do a small world size and then maybe move to a large one in the future when I have a better grasp of the game. Now, I did the tutorial, of course, like I like to do in management games, so I'm not stupid completely, but as always, I might forget something and I may not survive, so if you guys have any tips or suggestions, comments are always appreciated. We're going to turn off tutorial mode and start the map here. Thoroughly plan your... Okay, it's not even going to give me an option to read it. So I'm going to break down the game the best I possibly can. Uh, right now, we are set with a certain number of people, 10, obviously, who are full-grown and ready to work. Apparently, this is in the future. Everything looks very futuristic. And unlike other games where there's you can bring in other people from an outside source, we are actually going to grow people. <laughs> in the incubator, this nifty little machine is going to allow us to create people completely. Right from the uh, fetus stage all the way until they die of old age or whatever other disease they possibly catch down here because it's probably filthy and disgusting. But we're going to go ahead and grow some of them. Uh, we can grow three at a time. Now, just like any other management game where there's colonies, you do have to make sure that you keep your people to a minimum unless you can get more resources. So I'm only going to grow three right now. They're just going to take a while before they're done anyway. And they're going to be kids. They're not going to be able to do things until they're older anyway. So we have to wait a little bit of time. But as they do become kids, they use up resources. So it's kind of tricky to plan around that. So we're going to let that do its thing. And then we are going to start building the necessities that for some reason aren't already built in this bunker. We have all this nice little futuristic shit and people ready to go. But there are no bathrooms. There is no food sources. So we do have a storage for food. But there's not much in there. Oh, we do. Never mind. Do you want to change the storage type? Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, no, that can store fish. That's fine. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. I did the tutorial once. I paid attention to the best I could. So I know what we need to do first, and we need to start building things like beds and toilets and showers so that way we can stay as clean and rested as possible. We also need to grow some food. Basically, just like Planet Base, we need to get shit done right away. Um, so the options here, we basically have key one, two, three, and four that we can switch between the main things. One is to select, so we can start looking at stuff and have some options here. This one is for things like power grids and floors and walls, like basic construction stuff. And this is going to be all your other things, like doors, uh, fancy stuff like beds, even kitchens, farming equipment, other things of that sort. And the last one here is to destroy. This is what we're going to use to actually mine out some areas. So I'm going to expand just a little bit out here, probably do like this, and we're going to assign that. Now, since nobody can really do anything, we have to assign people jobs. They're here, but they're not doing anything because we haven't done that yet. Now, they're given a certain set or preset of professions, depending on the person. So this person could possibly be a farmer or janitor. I believe that's all based on genetics. I think in the future we might be able to breed people in the incubator to do specific things. So if we need doctors, we're going to be able to give them a specific set of genes, I guess. I don't know how it works just yet. They didn't talk about that. Uh, but that's in the future. Right now, they're given a random set. So right now, she'll be the janitor to keep the place clean. Um, you, apparently, as a guy, you're going to be a worker. So you're going to do things like tear these up. Uh, you can be an engineer. I think what's good to have a few workers, like three workers and three engineers would be good. And then everyone else can pretty much do whatever they want. Ooh, a scientist. I'm going to sign you immediately. If they have some quacky type of uh, profession, I'm just going to let them do it. All right, you're a cook. Good. Does everybody have a profession now? I think everybody does. What about you? Santa Claus, come here. 
I can't click you. You're standing in the middle of the doorway. All right, anyway. So we're going to do that. They're mining it out. I can't increase the speed, but I'm probably going to take it slow for the first episode because I don't want to fuck up too much. But uh, so they got that cleared out. Now we're going to lay down some floors. Uh, just some basic floors so we can get some things going here. And you can click and drag. It's nice. And then confirm over here. And then the, the workers will start building it. In this room, I'm going to dedicate to some beds. We need people to be able to sleep. I might have to do a little bit more out here. I think I'm going to, actually. I'm going to expand it just a little bit more. I don't want to work them to death, but let's get that done. And then I think I'm going to put up some walls just in case people don't come in. Now, the enemies, I want to talk about early on because I want to warn you, they come out kind of oddly. They're like mole people. It's very weird. But basically, if there's a cave-in that is anywhere where there's not a ceiling, so basically you can assume any floor I put down is going to have a ceiling accompanying it. So we can build on top of that when that time comes um, and below it as well. It's not just going to be one flat thing. That's also nice too. It's like a whole... You can build levels. That's great. Um, but any place that's not covered by that can have a cave-in. And the cave-in is going to cause little rifts in the ground and holes in the ground that the mole people can come up with. So the janitors have to fill it up with dirt to make sure it doesn't happen. So it's going to be surprising when they come out. And I think it's going to be... Um, it could end up being a huge problem. I don't know. But uh, I haven't ran into that in, in the tutorial. I mean, it's a preset thing anyway. So I guess we'll build some walls. And I think the walls are going to protect... Um, Protecting things from coming on the inside, and I think it adds a little bit more support. I'm not sure. I have no idea. We're learning, uh, but we'll set down some beds. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, and then we need materials, too, so eventually we got to get something going for that. But where is it? Uh, bed. Okay. We'll put some beds down. We'll put four right there. Um, yeah, because I can't do anything else, unfortunately. Four beds is fine. People can sleep at the, at the same time or sleep with each other, whatever. Um, so we need a place for showers, too. I'd like to get that going on. Uh, this is the edge of the map, I believe. Yeah, I can't go over there. Oh, got it built. And we do have an event menu over here, which is kind of nice. It tells you everything that's happening. So in case something happens, you can actually go back and see the messages that pop up to kind of retrace your steps and learn from your mistakes, basically. Um, but past the beds, I want to try to... I can't... See, I can't build over top of these. We need a tampered drill bit level one. I don't know how to research that. We get research points, uh, but it's actually kind of hard to get. Okay, so I literally can't do anything else. It doesn't look like I can expand. My I can expand out here. Let's do a doorway right here. Oh, I can't do that one. Never mind. Wait, can I? I, can I think I can. Yeah, I think they'll get rid of that, right? Let's go ahead and speed it up one time. We have two. We have an option to go double speed. I think. I think this is 1.5 and then double. Okay, they can do it. So we'll do this leading into here, which is going to be a big open room, which I'm going to have for the mining. St the mining things. I'm going to have to put a mine over here. That's going to be hard to access. Very hard to access. There's one over here too. Shit. But we have to go all the way over there. So we might as well get them working. Do a straight path. Oh, I can't. Okay, I'm going to have to do a... There we go. This might work. Yes, this works. Okay. <laughs> Get to work, guys. That's a lot of stuff to do. Um, we have enough people doing things. Um, did we grow any more people? Oh, they're in 85% embryo stage. Service priority. I see. Okay. We can disassemble it. Now, can we move it? Conduct water. Okay. So, we need to make a little room also over here, which I'm going to make to be... If we can... Let's see how this will work. Uh, we need a shower. I can't do that one? No, I cannot. Damn it. Okay, well, they're going to work on that. That's fine. Can we res- I want to get research points. I actually didn't get to the point where they talked about research points. That kind of sucks. We'll get it eventually. <laughs> Look at these guys. They're not even hitting the walls. They're just kind of drilling into the ground, and it's working. Hopefully, they all stay safe. That's a long way, man. All right, kids. Let's go ahead and plant. Where is it at? I think it's- Production, mining, yeah, we'll do that whenever you're ready. Uh, and this is the refinery, which we have to place on top of concrete. So I'm thinking we could put that here. Might be a good idea to do that. Concrete floor, just kind of, it's a two by three thing. So we'll do two by three right there. And we'll do regular tiles so we don't use up too many resources over here. Like that. This can just go and you guys can build that. There we go. Okay, now people need to go, I need to go ahead and set down the toilet and stuff, I can disassemble it later. Let's do the toilets and the showers. Shower pod, we'll put two right here, and then we'll do toilet cabins, um, 
Where's a good spot for this? Okay, not next to that. I could put toilets. See, they can't access it right there, though. I might have to tear this down. Let's try to... Oh, I can't. Yeah, let's tear these down. This will be a good place. And then I can put one here and then one here. So we'll confirm that. How far are you guys? Doing pretty well, actually. Might as well tear that one down, too. While you're at it. <laughs> okay, we got it all built. Let's put down the... Uh... Yeah, the refinery, which we'll place right here, and that'll get built whenever they're ready for that. Now, the conditions. It's not to status is good, and they're getting kind of tired. People need to use the bathroom. No diseases. We're pretty good. Now, warnings tend to tend to pop up, but I think it's going to be... Oh, we got people. We got new babies. We got new babies. Where are they at? Oh, look at these little guys. See, they can't do anything until they're older, but they are going to use up resources. It's kind of like The Sims. Uh, they When they have that weird language, but people like recorded it that way. Very strange. Okay, let's put uh, let's put some tile. Let's put the red tile down for um, the toilets. That'll be fine. And then hopefully we'll eventually be able to put up walls around all this stuff. Oh, but we need the toilets, which they're kind of far away. Um, that's going to be this uh, with the toilet cabin right there and right there. Now, we also need to attach the electricity and the the water to certain things so for instance i got attached the water basically i could connect the showers to anything that's already running through the water pump or to the water pump itself so that's going to work so essentially what i want to do is put one here here and it'll connect and then extend out and go here now this is all underground basically i'll confirm that this is all underground you can actually change the levels this is the power grid this is the water grid and this is the main grid okay so we actually went to the refinery that's good this needs to be powered it's out of power, so let's get a power cable going from that. Underground, all the way back to either something that's connecting like that, uh, and then we can connect out uh, to this. Boom. See, that's like an extension of power just because the light's there. Okay, something happened. Something happened. The Mole Man. Oh, shit. It's the Mole Man already. They're attacking. I don't know what to do. Do they? Are they fighting? Where are they? Oh, they're, are they right there? Where are they? Oh, there they are. Someone's bleeding. Did someone die? I think someone died. Uh, it was cut her food, stepped on a nail. Or, it's cut her foot, stepped on a nail. Strange. Okay, so what do we do? Okay, that's you, your health, your wound. It doesn't say how I can treat it, but I think that's just having a doctor around, which we don't actually have. Someone's got to be a doctor. You're a scientist. Let's put you to a scientist, just so we can... I guess that's going to increase our research points. Oh, shit. Small earthquakes can cause landfall and empty tiles until the janitors clean the debris. You cannot build on these. Okay. Well, let's get the janitors to clean on those. Please do that. Thank you. Okay, so that's running on power. I think we're good on power. Yeah, so we immediately had an attack. Yeah, everything's powered. Let's get these, the water grid, these things going on the water grids here. Oh, I cannot actually build on those. That's... Wait, I'm not even doing it right. Hold on. Here we go. Water pipe. That here... I'll go here. Um, I don't know if that's generating... It is generating water, so let's get that through here. And confirm that. Because those will both be pumped full of water. Cool. Those are being pumped through full of water, I think. Actually, no, it's not supplying any water. Oh, because they're not building it. Why are they not building it? Can they not build that? What is this, anyway? Mini reactor. Oh, this is power supply. Okay. Cool. Um... Now, are we gathering resources? We are. Building materials. We got a little bit of garbage. We have ore. Perfect amount of ore. We got to use the refinery to see what it's producing. Let's produce plus 100, I guess. One ore equals five. Let's see how that goes down. Yeah, okay. So we're producing a lot. Our storage is going to hold all the building materials right here. Um, it doesn't actually say. There we go. We have a ton of building materials. We could probably stop production right now. Let's stop. Can I put it in a number exactly? Okay, let's reduce that down. I think we're fine. Let's idle for a bit. This is mining a ton of ore. That's fine. Um, okay, fruits. Okay, we need to get vegetable pad in the kitchen up. I think all the water is good. No, because we haven't built these just yet. Why have not we built these? Why? Hold on, let me see. Water pipes. These aren't working, it seems. Do we not have enough workers? What are you doing? Profession. Janitor. 
You are a kid. Kids are just playing around in the mines. That's exactly where you need to be. Um, let's see. You're a what? A worker. Get to it. Can I sign you to do something? Or it's an engineer, I think, builds it. We're all the engineers. Okay, you're an engineer too. I don't know why it's not connect- is it not- is it not working properly? What's going on? Do we not have the materials for that? There we go. Uh, just replace it. Say yes. So they're waiting to be built. But nobody's gonna do it. Why? Why is nobody doing that? Okay, that's fine, right? Okay, yeah, the, the toilets are running, but the showers are not. Let's try something else. Um, let's try to put it there and confirm. Somebody? Okay, I might have to move that thing. Oh, there we go. What about the other one? Oh, you can't reach it. Can you not reach? Oh, I see. You can't reach it. Okay. We'll make this work. We'll make this work, guys. Alright. It's already been built. So we'll build it like this. There we go. Well, there's already an extra pipe if anyone wants to go ahead and take care of that. And no one can reach this one, so unfortunately, we're gonna have to put it out here. Like so. There we go. When they can reach it is when the water will start flowing. Now that's an empty old pipe. I need to disassemble that. Disassemble that if I can. I can't, unfortunately. Okay, well that's fine. <laughs> Um, all right, let's place down some more tiles to cover this up just to make sure the dirt doesn't get all Meshed up. Uh, this is gonna be something over here. Oh wait Is that right? Oh, yeah, they have to build it first. There we go That's good enough All right, that's working on the mines. All right, so we got that stable. Let's go ahead and build a kitchen Which I'm thinking back here would be good, but unfortunately I can't extend upon that. We have no research points I don't know how to set the scientists to do stuff our residents are starving. You should draw attention to this before it's too late. Yeah, let's do a kitchen. Um, let's do a kid kitchen. We'll put it right here. Oh, it's not good enough. Damn it. No, 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 no. I didn't mean to. Didn't mean to. Disassemble. Uh, shit. Kitchen. Uh, we'll put it right here. Fuck it. Right. Go do it. Build that thing. And then we have a cook, so a cook's gonna make it, and then we need a vegetable farming thing, which is going to be put... It's kind of weird that we can even do that here. I find that very odd that we can do that. So this has to have a little bit more room, which we don't have. Ah. Could potentially put... It. Where do I put... Okay, vegetable... Can only be built on a metal floor. Okay, so we need to build a floor with metal. Let's try to go ahead and destroy... Something that we... Yeah, like right here. Um, let's just clear all this out, honestly. This would be a good idea. Clear that out. <laughs> These guys are mad. Alright, so how are the people doing on food? I don't know how this much this produces. It's idle. Cooked meals, none. So the maximum number of ingredients available. Okay, we have to use food for that. Can we, do we not have any fish stored? We don't. Okay. Get to it. Um, someone, is someone dying? Is someone dying? What does that mean? Okay, destroy that stuff. Dissemble that. Please. Okay, and then I don't know if we can even put this here. It's a huge patch. Oh, this would be right here. Okay, I don't even care if they can walk. Oh, damn it. These people, these people are obnoxious. Um, damn, I have no, there's no room. I can't even, I can't even do it. I might have to tear this up. Let's tear this up. Um, can I not? Okay, I had to tear this up. Boom, boom, done. Get it done. Come on, guys. Tear it on up. And then the vegetable pad can go there, I think. Oh, we put the metal floor there, sorry. Um, uh, metal. Hurry up, guys, come on. You guys are hungry, right? You guys are hungry, oh, shit. Where? Anything weird going on? Nothing, okay, people are sleeping. Good. Put the metal down here, confirm that, build it, get it done, and then we'll go ahead and craft up uh, that vegetable pad. <laughs> Hopefully we don't die by then. Come on, guys. Come on, we need to make some damn food. I, I basically need to make sure I look through all this stuff to see what can possibly be built, so that way we don't have to worry about it. So the storage container is good. We're containing some ore. We need something for vegetables. Building materials, I don't know what that one is. Oh, just anything? Okay, this will hold vegetables. 
Yeah. Vegetables. Okay. I don't know what this is. Fruits, grains, boom. Okay. We'll do we'll do vegetables for now because it's a vegetable pad. And they'll build that. What is this? Uh has has become old enough to work. Sweet! Not enough space for fish, building more fridges. Or build more fridges. Fridge is empty. Cooks don't have enough ingredients for cooking vegetable. Okay. So it's been constructed. Let's produce. We have no farmer. We don't? I thought we did. You're a farmer. Go to it. You are a farmer. Go to it. Get to it. Come on. Is it good? Uh, how do we... Let's put a priority on that to 10. Waiting for planting. I don't know how this works. No farmer. Uh, okay. Durability shows I'm an object. Uh, why aren't they doing anything? All right, let me try to get some information. Can I get some information on it? Oh, there's no water. Right, 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 right. See, this is this is why I need to pay more attention. Okay, we're going to connect that and get two water sources. I think people are getting angry and old. <laughs> I think people are going to die of old age eventually. Come on, guys, build that. Thank you. Okay, let's go back to this. What else does it need? It has, it has uh, isn't getting power. Okay, the blinking light. So it is getting power. Let's make sure it is, though. Yeah, it's getting power. That's fine. All right, so start building some stuff. Woohoo! All right, so someone's assigned to it. Very good. So then we start getting some vegetables to be able to make some damn food. Um, this, oh yeah, this is also not getting water or power. God, I need to remember to do that. Every single one. I know you guys are probably already yelling at me. We'll get two powers, and we'll get a water source. Um, going all the way back out here. Wait, no, let's keep it like, I, I want to keep it out of the way as much as possible. Like that, uh-oh, what is that? The Mulman just took up a hole. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Where are the Mulman? Oh, we got him. Oh, look at that thing. The blood is like a mist. Oh, and he's dissolving. So weird. All right, let's plug up that hole, man. Okay, so everything should be functioning properly now. It needs water. Oh, it's not being built yet. It needs to finish being built. Okay, that's... Is it not getting water? Okay, they can't get to that. That's right. They can't get to it. Fuck. Oh, wait. Confirm it. They may not be able to get to that. Shit. What, another thing? What is that? The fridge looks empty. Cooks don't have enough greens for cooking. I know. But uh, right now, we need to focus on getting this water done. We might have to go all the way around for this one. All right, they already got that one. Um, so let's do this. And just straight back is fine. We can rework the pipes eventually. But we may not even be able to do these. Yeah. There we go. Right on the edge. Connect them. Come on, guys. How much veg? How is our vegetable pad doing? Good. We're doing well. Okay, so what's our vegetable fridge looking like? Vegetables. Zero out of 40. Okay. I don't know... Need a farmer for cultivation. Yeah, set the farmers to do the work. We need more people. So who's old enough to do stuff? No profession. You're going to be a farmer. You are going to be a worker. And you are going to be a cook. Oh, shit. More, more landslides. Or earthquakes. That's causing it. Um, now, what else can we build? This is just basic stuff. So all the stuff that I know that I'm eventually going to need is all going to be here. We've got the showers... Oh, we could use the canteen table for them to eat when they're when they're, they're ready to eat. We got the kitchen, the infirmary, and research station. Let's place a research station down somewhere. I wonder if there's a little area. Yeah, like right here. No. Let's put it right... Can they walk past that? I don't know if they can walk past that. They may not be able to. That's fine. We'll build... Let's, oh, yeah, let's build it right there. That's actually going to be good. Let's just build all this shit out. Honestly, actually, that's fine. Leave it. Oh, I can build that. I can go over that? I did not know. I was not aware I could do this. Oh, is it only those I can't do? Oh, wow, I'm an idiot. All right, let's confirm that, and then we can make some good stuff. I'm an idiot. I thought I couldn't build over this, because last time I clicked on them, it said I couldn't. All right, so we're all starving. No food's being made. Oh, damn it. Someone died. <laughs> Where's the dead person? Now where? Okay, so so are we making vegetables or not? I can't tell. It seems like one of the water pipes is broken. Engineers should easily fix that. That's fine. We have no vegetables. This is all getting power. This is getting power. This is not getting water. Why are you guys not getting water? 
I put it down. You are getting water. Oh. Someone needs to be an engineer. Like now. What are you? Scientist? You're fixing it, right? Go to it. There you go. Another one died. Fridge is empty. No. Okay. Well, we had a death, but the vegetables aren't doing anything. Cultivation... I don't know... How do I know if it's even creating... Okay. There's nothing in here. No stored vegetables. Alright, I'm not gonna make any more kids, because that's just probably gonna stretch it a bit. I don't know... Mm, my first run, and I'm already doing absolutely terrible. Absolutely terrible. Okay, so we got everything running. Are we making food? We are not making any food. Can you please fix up these vegetables? Why is it not working? 65%, 66%, let's speed it up a bit, I guess. 7, 68, people are gonna start dying. I do like how it turns into like squeaky, squeaky noises. Okay, so we got that. Incubator we got, refinery, we're all good on that. Resting zone, that's no biggie. Farming is the only thing we can do right now. Fridge, storage container, waste container, which we have, that's fine. Um. And then, yeah, that's pretty much everything we have right now. Mini reactor, the power switchboard, the water pump, water switchboard, someone died of starvation. Residents are starving. Yep, someone died again. <sighs> well, I don't know why the vegetables are taking so long. Did we make any? We did. We got five veggies. Oh, wow. Everyone is dying. Well, that's, uh, that's, uh, life in bunker, guys. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> no janitors. Okay, well let's assign- Oh, you're dying too. Man. This is- see, what I thought was gonna be a, a, a relaxed game is definitely- Look at these guys attacking! Holy shit! Oh man. Well, this was a great first run. This is a great first run. Ah, oops, something just broken down. What? You don't need to do sooner, who will quickly deal with this issue. Okay, well... Damn. Um... This is bad. How many people do we have left? Two? Just two people! God, this colony is not gonna last very long at all. See, I played the tutorial, and I thought I got it down, but then it's- it's- yeah. Yeah. It's bad. What is he doing <laughs> stretching? The oxygen levels begun to decrease. Okay, well, something bad has happened, and it's just sprung a huge thing of- how bad is the power? What's the wrong with the power on that? What's wrong with that? Oh, it's mining, but it looks like it's in the power. Oh, it's I'm just, isn't getting the power. Okay, down to one person. How are you gonna handle this guy, Bob Wooding Wong Yotin? What what's it Wong Yotin? Are you gonna be able to handle this by yourself, man? You gonna make some food for yourself? Oh, he's cooking. See, we could we didn't need to starve. We definitely did not need to starve. He's gonna take it all the way back. To the table and sit by his lonesome son. What? Did you just store food? Why? Why don't you eat? How are you doing? You're uh Tell the resident to have a break. Okay. Take a break, buddy. Uh you could work out, I guess. You're starving. Let's eat. Eat something. Eat. Ah, power cables has been damaged. Man, this is terrible. I mean, I already knew that this was gonna happen. The mole rats are gonna come out and eat his face now. We got stuff laying around too. Uh, that's a skull, is it not? Yeah, those are skull. Those are skulls. Those are all of our dead residents. Man, I am the best warden ever. Yep, there we go. And he's dead. <laughs> oh man, the oxygen level is critical. Yeah, why are you telling me this now? The last guy is dead. He is gone. Ah, uh, how does the game end? I'd love to see it. All residents of Paris along with the dreams of a clear future. Yes. <laughs> Holy shit! Look at that. That's beautiful. That is very beautiful. Ah, uh, well, that was our first run, guys. Actually, perfect timing. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm very sorry for those of you who are looking to see me survive. It's actually a little bit more difficult than I thought. When I played the tutorial, I obviously it didn't register in my head that it was going to be a little bit dumbed down in a, tim, in a, in a sense of complexity just because um, it's trying to teach you the things and it's going to have a set scripted amount of things happening. But with all of that happening, it's very hard. Actually, what I really, really would like in this game, I feel like, is a menu on the side or just an indicator of how many of each specific job we have going on. Unless I missed that and someone can point that out, I didn't see anything like that. It's kind of hard to just click away at people to see 
who does what, um, instead of having a random indicator telling us we don't have anyone for that specific profession. So that would be nice to see. Otherwise, I actually kind of enjoy the game. I'm going to play it again. Uh, hopefully, if you guys want to see some more, again, leave a like and leave a comment letting me know because it really helps me know that you do. And I'll post the next one as soon as I can. I really enjoy the game. I think it's doing well so far. Again, if you want more information, links are in the description below. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, like, share, favorite, and subscribe. And as always, I love you, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.